Andy Katz here with a look back at the WCC in men's basketball. Uh, but let's first look forward because this Saturday, St. Mary's is at Gonzaga. ESPN's College Game Day is going to be there. It's become one of the best rivalries in college basketball. It just does not get a lot of national attention. So good on ESPN to bring game day there. St. Mary's can clinch at least a share of the regular season championship if they beat Pacific on Thursday. Gonzaga, prior to that St. Mary's game, they got to make sure they take care of San Diego. Some milestones, got to watch for Drew Timmy. He scored 34 points on Saturday against Pepperdine and now sits at 2,117 career points. He passed San Francisco's Bill Cartwright for eighth on the WCC career scoring list. Timmy paces the WCC in scoring at 21.3 points per game, which puts him 12th nationally. St. Mary's has won 16 consecutive conference home games after they knocked off BYU, it was BYU's last trip to Moraga. St. Mary's also ranks fourth in the nation in scoring defense at 58.9 points allowed. LMU's Cam Shelton has had a phenomenal season. Shelton posted a career-high 40 points, including 11 points in the final three minutes, and the go-ahead basket with seven seconds left in the Lions' 90-88 comeback win over Pacific. He became the first line to reach 40 points in a game in 32 seasons. Shelton is second in the WCC in scoring, averaging 20.9 points per game, which is also good for 15th in the nation. Now watch out for Santa Clara, especially in Las Vegas, for the tournament. The Broncos are riding a five-game winning streak into the final week of the regular season. Santa Clara beat BYU in Provo for the first time since 1972. Brendan Podzinski, look, he's had a great season for Herb Sendek and the Broncos. He ranks third in the WCC in scoring at 19.5 points per game, and he collected 26 points in Thursday's win over the Cougars.